As a parenting coach, I get asked for strategies all of the time. If I got a pound for every time someone asked for a strategy, I'd be a millionaire. The thing is, so much comes before strategies, so I don't just like to give them out. Take, for instance, someone who's coming to me to, you know, deal with their child's anger and they're like, hey, I need a strategy for dealing with my child's anger. One, really, we need to look at the parent's anger first. But two, often the child is already holding the key to the strategy. Think about your child when they're angry. Think about what they might do. That child who stomps their feet, that child who uh, sticks out their tongue, that child who runs around the house, that child who picks up things and throws them is doing what their body naturally wants to do. So we can safely help them do that more. You're angry, stomp your feet. You want to run. Let's open up the doors and run into the garden. Let's release that charge that's in the body. The children are often already doing exactly what they're meant to do and us as their parent can help them do that in a safe way not only that we can give them opportunities when they're not at 100 when they're not completely up here on their thermometer and we can give them opportunities to release their anger in other times of the day but have a think about your child when they're angry have a think about what their body does and how you could perhaps facilitate that safely do more of that not the strategies i'm going to be here giving you